Hi, this is Steve Strickland with CamTech Engineering, and today for Mastercam Monday, we're going to focus in on those graphics enhancements that are included in the Mastercam 2020 release. Now, these enhancements allow us to configure and customize certain elements of our Mastercam experience. In this video, we're going to walk through what those elements are and how we can easily configure them to our liking. So let's go ahead and get started. The first item I want to take a look at here is relating to chain highlighting. If I go over here to my toolpath manager and click on geometry, the chain manager is going to pop up and all my chains that I have set up are automatically highlighted on the screen. Now in previous Mastercam releases, I did not have the ability to change the color in which our chains are highlighted, but now in 2020 I do. So if you go over to, to file and go down to configuration and go to colors, um, chain highlight now presents the whole color palette to choose from. So if I wanted to choose a, let's say a dark green here and say okay and save my system configuration file, when I go back out here and go to geometry, I'll see that now my chains are highlighted in the green color that I selected. So it just gives me an ability to really customize my experience with respect to chains. The next time I want to take a look at here relates to the ability to change colors of certain elements. When I go into file, system configuration and then under my colors tab I'm going to notice I have two new options. I have a tools and holders and I have a simulation display. In the tools and holders it allows me to really change and configure um, certain elements of my lathe operations, my mill operations, and my router operations. If I go over to simulation display I can change the colors of collisions, fixtures, and sections. An important note here is these will only change and only show within the Mastercam simulator. The final graphics element I want to talk about here relates to the configurability of the translucency option under the view tab. So there's times when working with a model, we turn on translu translucency to be able to look through the model and see the backside without having to rotate the model completely around. And in previous Mastercam releases, we didn't have the ability to change the opacity or how easily it was to see through a certain model. Well, now in Mastercam 2020, we have the ability to do so. And I'm going to do it by going to Shading Options. And I, I'm presented a slider here to where I can change the opacity percentage and make the model um, easier to see through or more difficult to see through. So there again, just another uh, knob to change uh, the configurability of how I can use translucency. So this is going to close out our Mastercam Monday on the graphic enhancements in Mastercam 2020. We hope you enjoyed it. We hope you found these features useful. And we hope you tune in next Monday as we continue to walk through the Mastercam 2020 release. Thank you.